Hi guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I want to show how to make this character animation with Duik Basil 2 in After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, vector from freepick.com, I will add download link and project files. First one, select this background layer and lock. Select hand left, go to solo and select puppet pin tool. Let's add one puppet here, one here and here. Click session tool, change puppet engine legacy. Click OK. Okay, and let's unsolo. Select this hand right, go to solo. And again, select puppet pin tool. Let's add one puppet here, one here, and here. Click session tool and change puppet engine legacy. Let's unsolo. Select this left foot. Go to solo, make someone, go to puppet pin tool, add one puppet here one here and here click session tool and again change puppet engine legacy and unsolo and finally select this foot right go to solo and make again puppets one here and here and here click session tool change puppet engine again legacy okay let's unsolo then select body go to solo and select palm behind icon. Let's move to here. Okay, click session tool and unsolo. And select this here. Go to solo. Let's select this anchor point. Let's move to here. Click session tool and unsolo. Let's link to body. And select here. Again, let's let's try move to anchor point here. Press air. Let's see. Okay, let's move to here. Okay, not bad. So, select these eyes. Let's link to here. Okay, and in this time, go to window, open Duik Basil 2, and click this icon for go to rigging. Then, select this hand left, go to FX control, select this puppet, and click add bones. Okay, we have three bones. Let's select this puppet pin three. Link to puppet pin two. Select puppet pin two. Link to puppet pin one. And select these three puppets. Go to Duik and click auto rig I key. So we have controller. Select controller and let's see. Okay, very nice. Okay, so select this puppet pin two one. And let's link to body. Let's say body, press air, let's see. Okay, very nice. And in this time, select these puppets and let's hide layers. Okay, and we can click here, then go to click this icon for hide all layers. Nice, let's change this name, hand left. Then select this hand right. Go to FX control, select this puppet. And go to DUI, click add bones, select puppet pin 3, link to puppet pin 2, select puppet pin 2, link to puppet pin 1. And let's select these three puppets, go to click auto rig I key, select controller, let's see. Okay, nice. And select puppet pin 1, again link to body. Let's select these three puppets, hide layers, and click this icon for hide in timeline. Okay. So, select this foot left, select puppet, and click add bones. Again, make someone, say puppet pin 3, link to 2, select 2, link to 1. And select these three puppets, click auto rig I key. Select controller, let's see. Nice. And select this puppet pin 1. Let's link to again body. And select 3 puppets. Click hide and this icon. And finally select this foot right. 
select puppet, go to click add bones, select puppet pin 3, link to 2, select 2, link to 1. And select the three puppets, go to click auto rig. Let's see. Okay, very nice. And select this puppet pin 1. Let's link to body. And select three puppets. Let's hide and click this icon. So let's change names for controller. Select this and change name hand right. And select this foot left. And this foot right. Okay, select body. Let's see. Okay, nice rigging. So select this body, head and eyes. Let's move to up here. Okay, select body again. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So let's close Duik. And in this time, we can make animation. So let's create new null object, right mouse, new and null object. And hold control, double click palm behind for move anchor point center. Click session tool and move to here. Then select these controllers and select body. Let's link to null object. Select null, let's change name full character. And select this null, let's see. Okay, very nice. We can animate it full body with null object. Let's press P, make new passing keyframe and go to here. Let's move to right like this and go to here, move to down and go to here. This is random keyframes. You can make your keyframes how to like you. And let's move to left and go to here, move to up again. Let's see animation. Okay, select keyframes. Let's hold alt, move to right and make easy. Let's change quality quarter. Let's see. Okay, select keyframes, right mouse, keyframe interpolation, change auto bezier to linear. Click OK. Okay, nice. So in this time, let's select this hand layer. Let's press P, make new passing keyframe. And let's go to here. Let's move to right. And go to here, move to left. Let's see. Okay, not bad. And go to here. Let's move to right. And here. Let's move to left. And here. Move to right like this. Let's press N for select work area 7 second. Let's animation. So select this hand controller right. Press P. Make new passing keyframe, go to here and let's move to up. Select this phone, move to here. Let's see, okay. And let's select this phone and press P. Let's hold Alt click this time icon right here, wiggle and one nine. For done expression, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay, and select this hand right controller, go to here. And let's move the down hand like this. Go to here. Move like this and go to here. Again, move to up. And here. Okay, select key frames. Let's make easy. Let's see. Nice. So let's select this foot left and press P, make new passing tree frame. Go to here. Let's move to back like this. And go to here. Let's move to down.
Okay, go to back again, move top. And go to here. Move to down again. And here. Move to like this or this. Okay. So go to here. Let's select keyframes. Make easies. And select this foot right. Again, press P. Make new passing keyframe. Go to here and let's move to like this. And go to here, move to right. And here, move to left like this. And here. Okay, and finally here, move to like this. Again, select keyframes and make easies. Let's close keyframes and select this phone. Okay, and let's close keyframes. Select this here, press R, go to here, make new rotation keyframe, and go to 10 keyframe. For shortcut, you can use hold shift, press page down in the keyboard, or click here and write plus 10. Click OK and chain rotation like this. Let's go to here, make new passing keyframe, go to again 10 keyframe, chain rotation like this, and go to here, make again new rotation, and make some one like this. And say keyframes, make easies. Let's see. Okay, not bad. So finally select these eyes, press S, click this icon, go to here, make scale keyframe and go to 3 keyframe, 1, 2, 3, change scale 5, let's zoom, change quality full, okay, go to 3 keyframe again, 1, 2, 3, change scale 100, and say keyframes, make easies, and control C, go to here, control V for random eye blink animation. Okay, not bad. Let's say again. Okay, nice. So friends, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.